On a small cruising sailboat, there's not enough room in the cockpit for a permanent table, as well as to use a table while under sail. But when at the dock, mooring, or anchored, a table in the cockpit is a wonderful addition to a small cruising sailboat. This video is about a Catalina 22's cockpit table on a new model of Catalina in the years of 1986 to 1991, and will also work on the older models of Catalina 22. Newer models of the 22, you'll have to make the adaptations, if possible, to your model. When adding a cockpit table to a 22-foot boat or a little larger boat, one will have to permanently add attachment devices that will somehow add discomfort one way or another to the occupants of the cockpit when the table is not there. This table is unique in that it works great on how the Catalina 22's tiller and traveler was designed. The table uses the tiller at the stern for support and location. The tiller support means that no table legs or post is used and no additional added items are permanently added to the cockpit floor or seats. The traveler above the tiller adds the additional support needed to keep this table design level, larger, and wobble-free when attached. Also, mounted at the stern keeps the rest of the cockpit clutter-free as well as lots of room to move in and out of the cabin. First, look at the curvature of the tiller in that it is straight from the rudder under the traveler and then curves up and then straight where you control it when seated or standing. The traveler above the tiller is level with the curved control part of the tiller. The curved tiller also swings above an average person's lap when sailing. What a perfect place for a table. The table is made of one quarter inch plywood for lightness of weight, reinforced with battens underneath to add strength. Edge fiddles are permanently attached to the outside edges that add strength as well as to keep items from rolling off the table. A fiddle was added to the back right before the traveler attachments. The table is coated with many coats of paint for smoothness and waterproofing. I would recommend the fiddles be a little taller. The fiddle at the back, I would make many openings in it to push off the morning dew if left uncovered for the night. Aluminum seat clamps were handmade to fit down over the traveler. The X bar on the new models and a little smaller on the round rod of older models. The thumb screw keeps the back corners locked down to carry any weight added to the front corners overhanging the end of the tiller. The back end of the table has a cutout right in the center for the traveler car. Wooden blocks were added beyond the seat clamp attachments at the traveler to keep these metal parts elevated above other items when the table is stored below. Thank you for watching. Maybe this video will give you, the viewer, some ideas. The awning and cushions in the cockpit are featured in video number 18, Five Diamond Canvas Projects.